Sean Penn's got a new film coming out called The Gunman. It's got Sean Penn, Academy Award winning Sean Penn. It's got Academy Award winning Javier Bardem. It's got Ray Winstone, who I think is just one of the most solid character mm-hmm. actors you could possibly get. You give me a hundred of him, I'll make great movies for the rest of my life. Idris Elba. It's got a solid, solid cast. The new trailer just dropped. Uh, look for it on YouTube if you haven't seen it already. Called The Gunman. It's got the, just a, the world of hitmen, mm-hmm. you know, which is always fun and great for me. But you're adding this level of drama. Sean Penn, I can't even remember how Sean how old Sean Penn is now, but he looks better than he, I think has ever looked. Um, I loved this trailer. I thought it was great. I like the beats of the trailer. I like how much of the movie it gave us. Um, I like the perform. You can just tell this is a, not an action centric film, although there's going to be a lot of action. This is going to be a character centric film. I love the dialogue in it. I love these performers. I love these actors. This suddenly, and I forgot all about this movie. I remember we talked about this movie when it was first announced it was being made, and I totally forgot about it. And then the trailer drops this morning, and I'm like, oh, my God. This is this one is probably going to end up in my top ten. Next week we're doing a special, an AMC special on uh, top ten most anticipated mm-hmm. films 2015. And I got to tell you, as of right now, I think this one is going to end up on that list for me. Mm-hmm. But anyway, you saw the trailer today. What do you think about I it? I actually wasn't that impressed with the trailer. I thought the trailer was okay. and It was just a bunch of stuff that we had already seen before. However, I am excited because of the cast. Like you yeah. mentioned before, I mean, uh, Idris Elba is also – he didn't win an Oscar, but he was Oscar nominated. Ray Winston has been in a bunch of, like – I believe he's movies. got a couple of Oscar nominations. Really? Too. Okay. Yeah. yeah. And he's always great in, in whatever he's in. And and the director is the director of the original Taken. So oh, that yeah. So totally that's a that. very which which is a very enjoyable. I I didn't watch Taken two, but I, I you know a lot of people say that wasn't as good. We have Taken three coming out. Um, but that makes it much more interesting. And, and the fact that Sean Penn is taking a role like this makes me a lot more interested because yeah. Sean Penn doesn't do action, really. Yeah. I mean, he's been in some movies that, like, uh, I mean, he was in Gangster Squad. But oh, he, what a disappointment. Yes. That, honestly, seriously, probably the most, not worst movie of the past couple of years, but disappointing movies for me in the past couple of years. Because mm. I was just talking about how we're going to do a most anticipated list. I remember when we did our most anticipated films list of 2013. Yeah. It was in my top five was Gangster Squad of Most Anticipated. And it was – it's just a bad movie. Such a bad movie on so many different levels. But yeah. Anyway. But but he doesn't typically take roles like that. I mean this is where he's the lead guy. Yeah. He's an action star. He's – I mean he's – I don't know how old he is. but He's, he's 54. 54. And he looks – fantastic at 54 he looks amazing but someone who has two oscars under his belt taking a role like this you got to think like okay maybe this is something worth checking out so i think i'm more excited from that standpoint hey everyone if you like this video click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our amc movie news youtube channel it's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news as well as our daily amc movie talk show Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.